everyone, and we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tenager, and I am playing some Mass Effect 2. I was doing some extra stuff, mining and things off screen, when um, something happened. I'm surprised by Thane's spiritual something. Yeah, sure that's nice. Scary or... That'll be all. It's okay, nice uh, that's anything. not what I wanted to. Come on, I'm trying to. How may I help you, Commander? As a crew. Is there anything I should know? Garrus received some news that put fire in Oh! Us. Maybe you should. Samara would like to see you in. Okay, in this is new. But also. That'll be all. It's always nice chatting. What she didn't say is the elusive man wants to talk to us. But I guess we also need to talk to Garrus and Samara, so we're going to do that too. Yeah, the elusive man wants to talk to us, and it's not letting me access the galaxy map <laughs> to mine or anything or do loyalty missions until I talk to him. Which means we're probably going to go on a mission automatically. We're going to, to finish the mission. And I checked, double checked to make sure that the next mission isn't the point of no return, because that would be bull crud. The point of no return is the mission after this. So you've got more than enough time to get everything done. Let's talk to Samara and to Garrus, and then we'll have everybody's loyalty missions. Uh, except for Thane, I think. Wrong side of the Normandy. Yeah, ex yeah, I think that means we'll have everybody except for Thane. Which will probably get the thing to go talk to Thane after this. And by this, I mean after uh, the elusive man's mission. Hi, Samara. You want to have a discussion? I am glad I joined your team. It has been too long since I traveled with companions. No. When the time comes, I will do whatever is necessary. I appreciate that. You're an important part of this crew, Samara. It is my honor. Even though we'll probably also, never take you on a mission. There is a matter I need to discuss. Okay. When we met on Ilium, I told you about a very dangerous person I was pursuing. Using the information you obtained, I have located her. She's been going by the name Morinth. I would like to apprehend her before she disappears again. Uh, urgency. Didn't you say you'd pick up her trail after our mission? I know where she is, right now. In a month, she may be gone. This is the best opportunity I've ever had. Then I guess we're going to help you, aren't we? Omega. Of course she is. called Afterlife which seems a perfect place for her to hunt. How important is this? What is Killing she? Killing her has been my focus for 400 years. Whoa. It is the most important thing in my life, and the reason I became a Justicar. Who is she? Tell me about her. She is an Ardot Yakshi. It is a term Don't know what that means. In sorry dialect. It means demon of the night winds, but that is mythology. She is simply a very dangerous woman who kills without mercy. Why the special name? So is an Ardot Yakshi a special kind of murderer? Morin suffers a rare genetic disorder. When she mates with you, there is no gentle melding of nervous systems. She overpowers okay. yours, burns it out, hemorrhages your brain. You end up a mindless shell, and soon after, you are dead. That's kind of... Bad. Isn't this ever mentioned in Asari literature? Yeah, why is it never mentioned? When we were primitive, there was much fascination with Ardot Yakshi. Some cultures worshipped them as gods of destruction. Now the Asari have a place in the galaxy, and they don't wish this defect to be widely known. As far as I know, only three exist today. Two chose a life of seclusion. The third ran. So Morinth. two chose not to kill people. Morinth! She ran, and I am sworn to kill her. Is it wrong to want for Edom? I don't know that I blame her for running. When she fled, she proved her addiction. She was not taking a great moral stand. She simply wants to keep killing. She's addicted she to killing. A great. Figure, but not a sympathetic one. Uh, compulsion. Can't she abstain? Each encounter gives her strength. The effect is narcotic. The more she does it, the more she needs to do it. Of course. She'll never stop. She can't. So you hunt down these Asari just because they're born with a genetic condition? It manifests with maturity. When one is diagnosed, she is offered the chance to live in seclusion and comfort. If she refuses, it shows her addiction to the ecstasy she gets from killing uh -huh. her mates. And then you have to kill there them. There is no redemption for such a person. That is not too extreme, actually. Because she's murdering people, but I can see why she's dangerous. This is definitely worthy of your full attention. She confuses her victims, twists their feelings. They will do anything for her favor. Let's go get her. We need to stop her. Thank you, Commander. There are no words to express what this means to me. There is one thing more. This creature, this... 
Oops. Monster. She is my daughter. Uh, she is my daughter. Is that, wait, what? <laughs> you said this is genetic. How many children do you have? Three. And three Ardat Yakshi are in existence today. It is as it sounds. Marinth was always the wild one. All three of her children are Ardat Yakshi. That sucks. But selfish. I'm so sorry, Samara. I cannot imagine what this is like for you. I do not want pity, Shepard. I'm not giving you pity! I do not accept it. My daughter's condition is my fault, and my redemption lies in killing her. That sucks. Do not pity me. Simply understand my situation. <laughs> Simply understand my situation. No! How did all this happen? <laughs> I spent my youth on the move, adventuring. I killed people, mated with them, or just danced the night away. I learned so much, experienced so much, and then my matron days came. I could find That's a lot of long back, times. Bask and enjoy my family. But in one moment, it was all taken away. Oh, cry me a river. So wow, really? I sat in a med lab while a nearsighted doctor droned at me, and I learned that nothing was as I thought it would be. I gave up all that I possessed. I owe nothing, claim nothing. All my knowledge will die with me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. the knowledge thing? That kind of sucks. destroy my own children. Uh. Those moments change you. And I have hundreds of years left to live with that. I say too much. Forgive me. That Help sucks. Me find my long lost daughter. And kill her. We'll get her. We'll, we'll get her, me. Samara. We'll do it. We'll do it, Samara. Okay, then. So there's her loyalty mission. We haven't gotten access to Thanes yet, but there is a certain little Garrus who's finally giving me his loyalty mission. And I did look it up, and like I thought, you have to complete his loyalty mission before you can romance him. So guess whose loyalty mission we're doing first after we talk to the elusive man and do his mission. Shepard, I'm glad you came by. Hi there, honeybuns. I may need your help. Okay. You remember Sidonis, yes. the one who betrayed my team? Yes. I found a lead on him. Really? There's a specialist on the Citadel. Name's Fade. He's an expert at helping people disappear. Sidonis was seen with him. Aha, uh -huh, and he's getting help to spear. What happened? How did Sidonis betray your team? Well, I know how, but... He tipped off the mercs. Told them where our base was. He drew me out with a false job, then let the mercs hit my team. My men weren't prepared. They tried to hold them off. By the time I got back, there were only two survivors. They didn't last long. All ten of them did. You, you think Garrus... You think Garrus would get a new suit now that I'm thinking about it? Because seriously, that thing is not very structurally sound now. What are you planning to do when you find him? You humans Kill him. have a saying. An eye for an eye, a life for a life. He owes me ten lives, and I plan to collect. You sure that's how you want to play it? I'm sure. I don't need you to agree with me. Yeah. I'd like your help. I don't need you to agree with me. Rah. Fine. Where do we find Fade? I've arranged a meeting. We'll meet him in a warehouse near the neon markets down on Zakara. I love how we arranged the meeting before consulting I appreciate me. You taking the time to help me. No problem, honey buns. Just one step closer to getting your romance. I mean, what? So let's go talk to Mister Elusive Man. He and I need to have a discussion. Apparently. The kind of it open you. Do I feed my fish? Hold on, we need to feed the fish. It's like, wait a minute, I couldn't remember if I fed the fish or not. That's very important and something we need to make sure we do whenever we possibly can is feeding fish. Fish! Got a little bit more fish, but we need more more fish. More fish. Doom. Doom 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 doom. Well, you're on low cover, vault over it by holding L forward and pressing X. I already know that game. Thank you very much for your insights. Um, there we go. And to the elusive man, elusive man, elusive Excuse man. Elusive man through commander. Okay. I 
that's better. Yes, I just moved the webcam over <laughs> slightly. It Shepherd, was just we easy. A break. What? I intercepted a distress call from a Torian patrol. They stumbled onto a collector ship beyond the Corliss system. Did they now? The Torians were wiped out, but not before they crippled the collector vessel. I need you to board that ship and get some hard data on the collectors. Find us a way to get to their home world. The Turian disabled it. How? I imagine how a Turian patrol could take out a collector ship. Reports indicate the hull's intact, but all systems seem to be offline. How do they, they turn it off then? Repairs as we speak. I'm not saying it won't be dangerous, but we can't let an opportunity like this slip by. Are the Turians investigating? If they had a patrol out there, why aren't the Turians sending a recon team in? They will, eventually. But I intercepted the transmissions. In the meantime, we're feeding them false reports. You're close enough that you can be in and out before the Turians learn the truth. He's lying through his teeth. This information's good. Information is my weapon, Shepard. It's good. <laughs> not, not as sharp of a weapon as the Shadow Broker. Send me the coordinates and I'll take care of it. Already sent. Once you're aboard the ship, establish an. It's got a little bit of a Edie. lisp. She'll mine their data for information regarding the Omega Four relay. Good luck, Shepard. His eyes are weird and probably infected with Reaper tech or something. Seriously, his eyes are just weird. Weird cybernetic eyes. Stretch. <laughs> Garrus, Tully, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Okay, nope. Nope. Done. So when do I use anything else other than Singularity and Warp, really? The ships don't look like ships, they look like asteroids. On the collector ship, Commander. Okay. Very low emissions. Passive infrared temperatures suggest most systems are offline. Thrusters are cold. Okay. Okay. How the hell did the Turians take it out? They didn't. Dun dun dun. Lidar scans do not detect any hull breaches on the side facing us. I detect no Mass Effect field distortions. It appears the drive core is offline. Okay. Mind if we win 30 seconds, Okay. Good luck. Doom, doom. Let's mess around with music. Doom, doom. And then the Normandy gets sliced in half. No? Okay. Ew. It's it it sounds all fleshy and grimy. Oh god, our helmets are on. I was looking at it. wait a minute, that's the vacuum of space. Tully was floating. I love what they've done with the place. <laughs> Looks like a yeah. insect hive. Penetrating scans. Something like that. An access node to uplink with collector data banks. Okay. Locking location to your heart suit can shepherd. I've compared the ship's and I need to cut herself off. Profiles. It is the vessel <gasps> encountered on horizon. <sighs> Maybe the defense tower softened it for the Turians. The missing Possibly. might be aboard. If they're still alive. I seriously doubt that. The collectors use these containers on horizon, but these are empty. That one's not been horrible. Trapped in these pods. Helpless. Completely at the mercy of the collectors. And that's a lot of dead what bodies. A lot of them seem to be missing their heads. They look like melted piles of goo. Uh, Why would the collectors just leave a pile of bodies? It's even worse lying than a around. pile of bodies. They must have been used for testing. If they were a control group, they would have been discarded at the end of the experiment. Maybe they're better off. There are worse things than death, like being a test subject for twisted aliens. I know you're right, 
But it doesn't make me feel <laughs> any better. But this doesn't make us any better. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. This place is gross. It's gross. Gross, 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 gross. Yeah, that's a lot of dead people. Why don't they just leave those bodies around? Also, they're exposed to the vacuum of space. They should be boiling. Me thinks. Power cells. I saw that. That's probably the way I need to go. Examine the terminal and horrible things happen, right? Like I accidentally turned the thing back on. That's a collector. Yep. Were they experimenting on one of their own? Yep. Edie, I'm uploading the data from this terminal. See if you can figure out what they were up to. Data received. Analyzing. The Something horrible. Running baseline genetic comparisons between their species and humanity. Uh, why? Are they looking for similarities? I have no hypothesis on their motivations. All I have are the preliminary results. They reveal something remarkable. A quad strand genetic structure identical to traces collected from ancient ruins. Only one race is known to have this structure. The Protheans. The collectors are Protheans! Oh my god. The Protheans didn't vanish. They're just working for the Reapers now. Yep. These are no longer Prothean Shepherd. Their genes show distinct signs of extensive genetic rewrite. The Reapers have repurposed them to suit their needs. Are you sure? You'd think somebody would have picked up on this. Probably not. had an opportunity to study a collector genetic code in this detail. It's got a point there. already matched 2,000 alleles to recorded fragments. This collector likely descends wow, that's quick. colony in the Styx Theta cluster. But there are signs of extreme alteration. Three fewer chromosomes. Reduced heterochromatin structure. Elimination of superfluous junk sequences. That's kind of horrible. Reapers didn't wipe out the Protheans. They turned them into monsters and enslaved them. Still, they're working for the Reapers now, and we have to stop them. No species should have to suffer through that. Yeah! That's what we need before the Collectors come to salvage this vessel. Move out. Yay, guns! Oh, that's cool. Wait, what? Oh, I can choose things. Oh, I can choose things. I want- oh, sniper rifle! I can now use a sniper rifle! <laughs> I can use a sniper rifle, sniper rifle- wait, where did those guns come from? And why do I suddenly know how to use a sniper rifle? Hey, where's the weapon slot? Oh, there it is. Yeah, first I want that, now I want this. I can use a sniper rifle! Sniper rifle! Sniper rifle! I got a sniper rifle! Is it equipped? Good. Sniper rifle! Sniper rifle! Probably gonna end up using the pistol most of the time anyway, but... Whoa! There must be hundreds of them. How many do you think are full? Too many. Probably all of them. It is probable the victims inside died when the ship lost primary power. Oh! Don't tell me that, Edie! What the hell? Don't tell me that! Okay, go up the- there you go. Freedom side lost their lives in the lost primary power. Don't tell me that, Edie! God! God damn, woman! This looks interesting. Cool, that's gonna be helpful. Commander, you gotta hear this. On a hunch, I asked Edie to run an analysis on this ship. Okay. Compare the EM profile against data recorded by the original Normandy <gasps> two years ago. They are an exact <sighs> match. The same ship dogging me for two years? Way beyond coincidence. Probably so not a coincidence. Watch your back. So this is the same ship that took out the Normandy. You jerk face. Kila. They could take wow. every human in the terminus systems and still not have enough to fill these pods. They're going to target Earth. Oh no way in hell! They are not targeting Earth. Not at all. Not any way, shape, or form. So this ship has been following me for two years. There, it's a bad thing. Looks like some kind of control panel. This Where is a trape. The collector crew? This is a trape. Careful, Shepard. Something doesn't feel right about that. Edie, this. This is a trape. Setting up a bridge between you and the collector ship. See if you can get anything useful from the data banks.
Data mine in progress, Shepard. This is a trap. It's a trap. Yeah, that's the sign of a trap. Definitely a trap. Uh, that can't be good. Yeah, no, that's not good. Status report now. Joker. Joker. What the hell just happened? Major power, sir. That'd be what I'd dark. say. Of course it was. Time for the reaper or the reapers. Well, yeah, I guess technically the reapers. Time for the gorgeous to attack, and now I have to fight my way off the ship. We need a little help here, Edie. I'm having trouble maintaining connection. There's someone else in the system. So Trojan virus. Okay. You okay there, Garrus? Great. Connection reestablished. I need to finish the download before I can override any systems. Then you better get it done fast, Edie. We've got yeah. <laughs> better get it done fast, honey buns. Enemy. Sniper rifle, favorite weapon in the series. Love the sniper rifle. Oh no 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 no. Oh no 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 no. You're not allowed. God, I love this weapon. Oh, I can still use it in that form. Alrighty then. Hey, what? what just happened? Unity. See you there. Okay, sniper rifles are hard in a game like this. I see you there. No! Not allowed. You have fun with that, I'm still going to kill you. Really? Tell that to, um, this. That's hurting, right? I should pay attention. This changes nothing, Shepard. Sure it does. It changes everything. Yep. I'm almost out of bullets for my sniper rifle. Okay, fine. No, I'm not using that. Are you silly? I'm using this. Where's Garrus and Tolly? No! Garrus? <laughs> it's like, how about nope? Sentient beings need never fear me, but I totally am! You're evil! So evil! So evil, it's not even funny! What do you mean my attack's an insult? Your face is an insult! Your face is an insult! Fuck! Is that it? Shepard, you must oh, manually reestablish my link to the command console. Okay. What is that light coming from anyway? It's like, ooh, why is there a sun inside the ship? You know about that. Now we're gonna have to fight our way out of the entire base. Yes? Yeah. Hi, Edie! I've regained control of the platform, Shepard. Thanks. I wouldn't let us down, Edie. I always work at optimal capacity. Thanks. Er, did you get what we needed? Yep. Yeah. Whatever I was supposed to say there. I found data that would help us successfully navigate the Omega Four relay. I have also found a Turian distress call that served as the lure for this trap. The collector's weak source. It is unusual. 
Really? It seems logical to me that they would have sent the initial message as bait. No, it is unusual because Turian emergency channels have secondary encryption. It is corrupted in the message. It is okay. not possible that the elusive man would believe the distress call was genuine. Ah. Why are you so sure? I found the anomaly with Cerberus detection protocols. He wrote them. He knew it was a trap? Why would he send us into a trap? He sent us into a trap. That bastard. That son of a bitch sent us right into collector hands. I'm gonna have a discussion with him. Cerberus can't be trusted. Garrus is tolly! <laughs> the collector ship is powering up. Balls. I do not have full control of their systems. I will do what I can. Sending coordinates for shuttle extraction. Okay. Let's move. We've got a time limit. Well, we don't, but we do. Run! Reminds me, how am I doing on my, uh... No, not save games. Silly Billy. Come on, you silly Billy. Still not what I meant. I just want to check my Paragon score! There we go. Get yeah, pretty close there. Anyway, that's going to be it for this video, guys. My name is Miss Garlet and we are playing some Mass Effect 2. I'll see you all in the next video.